Assalamu alaikum. How are you everyone? In this video, I will show you how, how to convert a 2D CAD drawing or CAD pattern uh, into a 3D wall cut in Revit. First of all, we need to go to one of the floor plans and uh, insert or import the CAD drawing uh, to Revit. Okay, I will look for my pattern. You can get it from the internet or if you have drawn it in AutoCAD and um, you want to transfer it to Revit. Okay, let's add it now. So now this is our pattern, but uh, it's a little bit big, so let's explode it first. And we can rescale it if you want. Uh, let's rescale it. Okay. Like this, maybe. Okay. And now we have 2D drawing in the uh, level 1 plan. And we want this to be a cut in our wall and in different plane. We need to transfer it to be a cut in the wall. But of course now we're in level 1 and we want this cut to be in a different plane which is on the surface of the wall. And how we can do this is first you need to copy the pattern, the, the lines, the normal lines, after you exploded them of course. And I also did some edits and left only these lines because that's what I need now. Uh, now let's go to the 3D view and before we paste anything because our drawing is still on the different on different plane we need to set our plane we need because it's originally on the level one we need to pick another plane just click on pick a plane and select the surface of the wall now the uh, plane is different it's uh, changed now and we can paste our drawing let's control V and as you can see okay uh, we can now rescale it if we want okay, like this for example and uh, then we can go and edit the profile but before we edit let's copy the lines again you have to copy the lines you have to do this step by step because if you forgot one step it will not be uh, it will not be done right okay now edit the profile you can use the pick lines and pick the lines but it will take a lot of time so the easier way is as I showed you now just paste and you can select the front area tick and the cut is created of course these are only lines we can remove them and as you can see the cut now is created let's open the shadows now we have a pattern cut into our wall that's what you need to know for this method uh, of course I think there are a lot of methods I uh, personally use this method if I want to create a cut uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave it in the comments. Thank you.